What's going on YouTube and welcome back to another less than five minute gear review and in this video we're going to be going over smoke and a pouches. The first being the Eagle Industries and the second being the Spectre gear. Now when it comes to the Eagle Industries, which is going to be this left hand side smoke grenade pouch, it's going to cost you anywhere from $7 to about $25 uh, and you can find it usually on Amazon or eBay. Now from the research that I've done, Eagle Industries has kind of condensed their product line and they're not making the smoke grenade pouch anymore, but you can still find them and it just depends on the condition as far as what you're going to pay, pay for uh, the price for the pouch. Uh, when it comes to construction, it's pretty simple. You have your exterior buckle and flap on the front side and then you have your molly on the back side with your snap links on the bottom. Uh, so pretty simple, straightforward, it opens right up and you just have your open pocket for your smoke grenade pouch. So that is the uh, Eagle Industries. It comes in multicam and tan and you can find both. Every now and then you can find some that are kind of more of like the Navy SEAL uh, multi or camo pattern as well as uh, Ranger Green. But I haven't seen a whole lot of those. I've seen mostly the tan and the multicam. The second being your Spectre Gear Smoke Grenade Pouch. Now you can find these on a couple of different websites. It's gonna cost you about $30 and um, it comes in mostly just solid colors, mostly tans and greens. Uh, but when it comes to the construction of this pouch, you have your molly on the back, so it's pretty straightforward. And then you have your buckle and Velcro flap on the front. And then you also have the elastic to help give that a little bit of an active retention in the event that this comes off. Uh, for any reason and then you just have your open pocket on the uh, interior So not a whole lot to it when it comes down to it Both of them have a little uh, hole in the bottom. So if you get dust or debris in the uh, pouch uh, It'll just fall right out the bottom So you don't really have to worry about the uh, pouch getting real dirty uh, on the interior and holding a lot of uh, Dust or dirt in there. So uh, with that said both of these will hold the army m18 smoke grenade uh, as kind of this as it's implied for what it's designed for, but in, con in conjunction with that, they will also hold a variation of the Enola Gay smoke grenades if you want to uh, purchase those and have those in your inventory. Uh, they're good to have, in my opinion, because they're cheap. Uh, they're more of a paper and cardboard smoke grenade if you don't know what Enola Gay is, and uh, it's pretty much a throw. Throw it, it burns, and you can forget about it. Uh, so it's pretty simple and straightforward when it comes down to it and they're an awesome product and like i said they're super cheap i think most of the enola gay uh like the x18 is going to be around 10 to 12 dollars i prefer their smaller lineup of smoke grenades because uh, you can carry more of them and uh and they're a little bit cheaper but when you start adding up the numbers it can be a little bit more expensive it just kind of depends on your personal preference i like the smaller compact size compared to these larger size uh, but with that said, one thing that I do want to take in or I do want you to take into consideration, most double mag pouches will actually carry a smoke grenade, so you don't necessarily need to buy smoke grenade pouches for smoke grenades. But that's just some food for thought if you're considering purchasing smoke grenade pouches. Uh, both of these companies are, have an awesome product. They also have double mag pouches, uh, so take a look at both of them. And uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to leave a comment. We'll answer any questions that you have. And uh, like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.